Welcome to Black History Moments with the Greater Faith Church of Deliverance. National African American History Month had its origins in 1915. Historian and author Dr. Carter G. Woodson founded the Association for the Study of Negro Life and History. It was later President Gerald Ford who officially recognized Black History Month in 1976, calling upon the public to seize the opportunity to honor the two often neglected accomplishments of Black Americans in every area of endeavor throughout our history. During this month, we have selected eight individuals and couples that have had an impact locally and abroad. Today, we would like to highlight one of those individuals. I was born December 19, 1924, in New York City, New York. I was an American model and actress noted for my vivid portrayals of strong African-American women. I won minor roles in a few feature films before portraying Portia in the 1968 film version of Carson McCullers' The Heart is a Lonely Hunter. Because I was committed to presenting only positive images of black women, I initially did not have steady work in film and television. My next notable role as Rebecca Morgan in the popular and critically acclaimed film Sounder 1972 for which I received an Academy Award nomination for Best Actress. In 1974 I appeared in perhaps my best known role that of the title character in the television drama The Autobiography of Miss Jane Pittman adapted from the eponymous novel by Ernest J. Gaines. My performance as the 110-year-old former slave whose life is depicted up through the civil rights movement of the 1960s won me two Emmy Awards. I have been honored by the Congress of Racial Equality, the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, and the National Council of Negro Women. In 1977, I was inducted into the Black Filmmakers Hall of Fame. I was named a Kennedy Center honoree in 2015. The following year, I was awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom. In 2018, I received an Honorary Academy Award. I am Cicely Tyson.